God's Secrets, Series 2. Good day, ladies and gentlemen, all over the world. I bring you greetings from our God Almighty. Today's video is titled God's Secrets, Series 2. My name is Dr. Yusuf Ajayi. I am speaking to you today according to my book titled God's Secrets, The Clues to Our Life and Existence. Published and now selling on Amazon.com. You can grab your copy today. If you want to know the truth, if you want to know the mind of God Almighty, if you really care to know the facts for my God Almighty, then watch my video, listen to me, and read my books. I am not speaking to you as a Christian, nor as a Muslim, neither as a traditionalist, but as revealed to me by the Spirit of God Almighty. My full names are Dr. Yusuf Babatunde Ajayi Atonda Omoni, which divinely implied as the Messiah, as the reincarnated Adam, the reincarnated Jesus, and the reincarnated Odudua according to Yoruba mythology. To begin with, the, part, the vital part of God's secrets are his goals. Goals are what you look forward to achieve within a span of time. Therefore, the greatest secret of God Almighty is his goals, which determines the reason why everything has been happening in the world or universe. Let us understand that in spite of all activities that has been happening, God is focused on his goals. God's goals are one to implement physical paradise in the course of evolution. Two, to create adequate spiritual beings to facilitate connection and communication between the physical and the spiritual, e.g. through evil means or through the provisions on our women. Three, God wants man to be creative as himself. Four, God wants man to fellowship and connect to him. Five, to manifest himself as man. Six, God wants to populate his kingdom. It is the plan of God to create heaven on earth as paradise. In his kingdom, where he shall reign forever in peace with humanity, devoid of this evil world and activities where God shall manifest himself as man living among and fellowshipping with human beings. However, these goals shall not materialize until there are adequate spiritual beings to facilitate connection and communication with the Spirit of God in the spiritual realm. To achieve the above, God has made provision of 12 women for every man as helpers depending on each man's destiny in his kingdom to grant man access into the spirit to achieve 
the expected result. However, because God Almighty decided to commence the process of man's evolution from a single source through Adam and Eve, he instituted this present evil world to create adequate spiritual beings or angels or Holy Ghost through the agents of the devil to kill, steal and destroy through all evil means such as wars, sacrifice, killings, ritual killings, tribal and religious wars prior to the next generation towards paradise until there are sufficient women to meet man's need. During this evil world, God also gives man the opportunity to imitate him by creating human copy of all he has created as evidence of the ability to obtain the required knowledge in the spirit for man to evolve. Therefore, to achieve his goal, God Almighty has instituted three circles of our existence in line with God's tripartite nature through which man shall evolve. Our existence are based on God's tripartite nature, which are three cycles. The first cycle was from the beginning until the formation of man by Obatala when he descended from the other planets to Earth. The second circle is this present earth, also referred to as the evil world, which shall soon be destroyed for a paradigm shift to the third circle called the godly paradise. In my last lecture, I stated the reason why killing of people by other people is prevalent in this evil world. However, to ensure our understanding, in this video, I am explaining further that because of the need to gain access into the spirit in God's presence to obtain knowledge power and control, man needs to create spiritual being which God has made provision for through our women in his kingdom. But due to lack of sufficient women from the beginning of creation, for every man according to his destiny, until paradise time, men decided to kill each other to meet this spiritual need. I tell you, woman is the source of man's problems and the solution to man's problem. In my future video, I will be explaining in more details about the secrets concerning God's goals, which I have mentioned today. Therefore, remember to press the subscribe button and the notification button to inform you of our future video. Thank you.